go to Trisha Thune for more. An activist known as Johnny Bark has taken residence in this beloved tree and refuses to come down. What is he protesting? The expansion of high-cost, low-quality mini-mansions like this one here. You gotta be kidding me. Before going to work, Michael decided to have a little fun. I'm doing a little cost projection analysis for a mini mall. Wow, it's pretty cool you know how to do all that stuff. Yeah, well, maybe your old man's just a little bit cooler than you thought he was. Don't! Ah, stupid! Stupid chair! If you're saying I play favorites, you're wrong. I love all my children equally. I don't care for Joe. Each with their new charge, the Bluths set about redefining their image. Tobias was off to Los Angeles International Airport, determined to return to his family with a career. Well, this is great. Why would anybody take a limo? What is this, like $12? Why would anybody pay more than $12 to go to the airport? Next stop, LAX. Oh, come on, we're stopping again. How many more stops are we gonna make? Honestly, I haven't even seen this part of Los Angeles. Is that snow? No, I'm serious. I, I think they are police boats. Prepare to be boarded. Prepare to be boarded. I knew it was against the law. As Michael was becoming more selfish, his father was choosing a more pious path, which made Buster and Lucille's visit go much differently than planned. Why is there a piece of shoe on your head? This is a, well, it's a reminder that the divine presence is always above me. Face it, Lindsay. Save one. Well, I'm not going anywhere. All your water's doing is wetting my appetite for protest. No hair for oil. No hair for oil. Fine. We'll drown you out with music. Quick it up. I'm in the mood to stand. Sad girl. Walking about the sand. And Lindsay discovered that the activism that came out of her desire for prettier hair really did boost her self esteem. Now there's someone who could have used a good mother. Whore! What time is it? Oh, almost sundown. I have to prepare for the Sabbath. It's Tuesday. Okay, we are just about ass to ankles back here, maybe. Do you want to hop on your cousin's lap there, please? Whoa, bumpy road ahead. My name is Dr. Tobias Fjunke. I was chief resident of psychiatry at Mass General for two years, and I did my fellowship in psycholinguistics at MIT. And this is I'm a Bad, Bad Man from Annie Get Your Gun. I, 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 I'm... Speech. 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 The family continued to chant speech, speech, speech for no one in particular. Justice cannot be blind, Doc. He's got a handle and everything. Come on, boy. He knew his father had always loved him, but at this moment, he was actually holding the proof in his hands. Unfortunately, it was at this moment that the investigators went into action. There's a kid. Cover's blown. Get out. Clean shot over here. No, no. Get the proof. He's got the evidence file. Come on. I told you to find a stud. Go. I need a favor. What happened to hello, I need a favor? I owe Hot Cops 500 bucks. Hot Cops? It's a stripping agency I used to work for. Cop uniform? Right. You know, I might have been just a little too believable. Police, open up! Uh. 
Okay, this is what I told Tobias you'd do. Say what you will about him, at least he's happy for me. <laughs> it's like she gets off on being withholding. Whoa, Buster. Look who's got something to say. <laughs> I'm mom, and I want to shoot down everything you say so I feel good about myself. <laughs> <laughs> Look who's ragging on the old lady. Hey, because hey, I'm an uptight <laughs> Buster! <laughs> you old horny slut! Well, no one's going to top that. I'm sorry, isn't Michael the least likable one in the family? No. There are very few intelligent, attractive, and straight men in this town. Well, that certainly leaves me out. <laughs> did... She said single. You did say single, correct? I... <laughs> thought I... There's my little girl. I've got great news. Daddy has the entire day off. But you have every day off. You don't have a job. Well, I don't need money to hang out with my daughter. Where are you going? We're going shopping. Oh, no, no, I can't do that. These guys, the SEC, they've been after me for years. I put you in charge. You're going to be wearing one of these orange jumpsuits, too. I could have helped You'd you. You'd be an accomplice. Me. No. It had to be your mom. They cannot arrest a husband and wife for the same crime. Yeah, I don't think that that's true, Dad. Your Honor, the purpose of a court of law is to find the truth, which is why witnesses swear on this. After all, they say justice is blind. Surely she has enough sight to catch the truth before it hits her in the face. Objection! Your... <gasps> but you've never actually had an audition. <laughs> well, excuse me. Excuse me. I have the Ike and Tina tuna. Plater platter. I don't understand the question, and I won't respond to it. As you may or may not know, Lindsay and I have hit a bit of a rough patch. Really? When did that start? Well, I don't want to blame it all on 9-11, but it certainly didn't help, but... That might not have been your fault. I know. Nothing works in this house. Tell me about it. Is that a shot at me? Probably. Because for your information, I got a job. Really? What kind of job? Beads. Bees? Beads. Beads? Job's not on board. Things had been tense since Tobias left his psychiatry practice to pursue an acting career. needs, you know. And how am I not addressing your needs? How can you even ask that? What is oh. this? Oh, go right to that. Good. Go right there. Real mature. Really great. Cheers to mom and dad, to Buster and Lucille. <laughs> Don't forget my girlfriend. To I meant. Tobias chose to pursue a common interest with his daughter. Oh, I hope so. Um, I'm looking for something that says, dad likes leather. Something that says, Leather Daddy? Oh, is there such a thing? Hey, gang. Mind if I squeeze in here for a moment? Oh! Look at us. Who'd want to mess with any of us, huh? Excuse me. Yes. Oh. Did you get a job or something? No. No, I didn't. Unless you consider world's coolest daddy a job. If I... <laughs> Okay, there he is. Now go on in there and surprise him. I'm gonna get us a few ice cream sandwiches. Go on. Go on. Hey, Pop Pop. How's prison? I'm gonna die in here. What? They're gonna kill Grandpa. Uh, I gotta, I gotta get out of here. Oh, I'm an innocent man. You gotta help Pop Pop get out of here. Give me your hair. Yeah. Give me your hair. Give pop up no your touching. hair. No yeah. touching. Hey, no hey. touching. Give me the hair. Hey, one of these got smushed, but don't let that ruin prison for you. 
So is everyone here? I think so. I haven't seen Tobias. In fact, Tobias had intended to come, but had a slight miscommunication with his cab driver. Where to, Mike? The Gothic Castle. Gothic Castle. That's what I said. And ended up in the wrong location. I didn't go with that outfit. Yes, hello. I am looking for the magic. Don't be shame. And Lucille was mingling with the elite of the Latino Television Academy. Can I get a vodka tonic, please? I'd like a vodka tonic, please. Vodka tonic, please. A sea of waiters and no one will take a drink order. Meanwhile, Tobias had arranged an audition for a local commercial. Lindsay came along to appear supportive. This could take a while. Honey, it's one line. <laughs> Not if I do my job right. First of all, I love it. Quick, quick question, though. Am I panicked about the fire, or am I being brave for everyone else? The fire. It, it's, it's a fire sale. Oh. <laughs> OK, I didn't, um, well, let's give it a shot. Oh my god! We're having a fire sale! Oh, the burning! It burns me! Evacuate all the school children! Ah! Oh, May! This isn't a fever! Sing, Greg! Can't even see where the knob is! <sighs> and scene. Um. Would you like to try that a little simpler, maybe? No. Buster was also mingling, but at Lucille's insistence, wasn't wearing his glasses. Como estoy? <laughs> Exciting night. <laughs> Do you see me more as the respected dramatic actor or more of the beloved comic actor? Whoa, 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 whoa. There's still plenty of meat on that bone. You take this home, throw it in a pot, add some broth, a potato. Baby, you got a stew going. Yes, that's fine. Uh, but I would like to focus on my acting, Mr. Weathers. I did give you my last $1,100. I'll tell you a little story about acting. I was doing the Showtime movie Hot Ice with Ann Archer. Never once touched my per diem. I go to craft service, get some raw veggies, bacon, cup of soup. <laughs> Baby, I had a stew going. I think I'd like my money back. And the family gathered to watch a videotape George Sr. had sent Lindsay and Tobias for their anniversary. Hello. I'm George Bluth. And for the next 45 minutes, let me take you on a journey. Good grief. He sent us one of his idiot videotapes. First this. You've seen George Bluth on videotape. You have got to learn to be alone. I cheated and I lied. And I hoard around. Caged wisdom changed my life. Now's your chance to own the entire George Bluth Caged Wisdom Library for only four payments of $19.95. This was supposed to be my anniversary toast. Sure. I wish you guys didn't have to go so soon. Oh, on that subject, these guys are actually going to be staying with us for a while. Just your aunt and her husband. Not Joe. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. What the hell, huh? Family first, right? It is going to be a little crowded, though, so I think you're going to have to share a room with your cousin. Hey, what you trying to say to me? On the next Arrested Development, Buster's competition heats up. Whoa, 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 We are not allowed to have candles in here. Mom would freak. Oh, no, it's fine. This is America, baby. You pray how you want. I'll light a candle of my own. That's exactly what I'll do. 